Hi guys, welcome to another product video. My name's Graham and you're watching Burn Media TV. Today we're going to be looking at the Kano Computer Kit, which is a little PC developed for kids to teach them how to code and how a PC works. The system is built on a Raspberry Pi B+, and initially launched on Kickstarter, where it managed to, ra managed to raise $1.5 million in funding. So let's see how easy it is to put this thing together. So here is the Kano packaging. Comes in quite a nice sturdy cardboard box. And when we open it up, you'll see almost all of the items are displayed right in front of you. So the main piece of kit we're gonna be using is the Raspberry Pi motherboard. When you're doing it for the first time, you'll be using the first Kano book, which tells you how to actually put the entire system together in very colorful images and very easy to read text. So, the first thing we'll be doing is taking the Raspberry Pi and putting it into its casing. You just slide it in there. And slide it in a bit more. And there we go. It's sitting in its chassis. Next up, we'll be giving it some sound with its onboard speaker system. So this is probably one of the trickiest things to actually put together, just because the sound cable needs to go in a very specific slot on the board, which is right here. And then we feed the headphone jack through the top piece. Is a bit stiff. Okay, plug it in there, and here we go. Now we plug the headphone jack into the 3.5 millimeter adapter, and our PC has sound. Now it's time to give it some Wi-Fi. The Kano comes with its own little Wi-Fi dongle. Very nice compact device, which you put into one of the USB slots. It's going to need an operating system, and the package comes with a 8 gig micro SD card, which has the operating system and all the applications you need. And that goes in the underside of the device and just slots in. From here, We've got the keyboard, which is the main piece of kit we'll be using when operating the, K the Kano Micro PC, which includes a trackpad for your mouse. It has a little wireless dongle, which slots into a USB slot as well. Nice and tight, so you can control your PC. Then the last two pieces needed is the HDMI cable. To give you a display. So yes, the Kano only comes with an HDMI cable, there is no other type of connector for it. So if you're going to purchase one of these, your screen is going to need HDMI. Just take off the clips. There we go, comes with a nice long cable. There we go. And finally is our power adapter. Comes in three pieces, which again you just slot together, as well as a micro USB cable for power. So this end will go into the Kano over here. And then this end will go into the power adapter. And there we go. That's the system. Easy as that. <laughs> 